वेलकम बैक डियर स्टूडेंट्स टू द फिजिक्स विजन क्लासेज गिवन फंक्शन इज ऑफ फॉर ईयर सीरीज एंड गिवन बाय फॉर दिस गिवन फंक्शन एफ एक्स इज माइनस वन और वन फ्रॉम माइनस पाई टू जीरो एंड जीरो टू पाई वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट इट्स फोर ईयर सीरीज एक्सपेंशन ओके सो लेट सी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट एस सी वॉट इज फोर ईयर सीरीज एक्सपेंशन दिस इज गिवन बाय ए नॉट बाय टू प्लस समेशन ए एन कॉज एन एक्स प्लस बी एन साइन एन एक्स ओके नाउ द गिवन फंक्शन इज माइनस वन फ्रॉम माइनस पाई टू जीरो एंड प्लस वन फ्रॉम जीरो टू पाई एज वी कैन सी इट इज एन ऑड फंक्शन इट इज ऑड फंक्शन सो फॉर ऑल द ऑड फंक्शन we have we have all the ans all the ans equal to 0 all ans are 0 so we are left out with this term only which is given by so fx is given by summation of summation is from 1 to infinity for bn sin nx okay n is from 1 to infinity and what about bn Where, what is b n? B n is given by one upon pi limits from minus pi to pi, and then we have f x with sine n x, right? So what we need to do? We just need to substitute the value of the function now, and we need to integrate. So let us calculate b n, b n. For bn, we'll split it into two parts. One upon pi is common in all. First part is from minus pi to zero. At that particular, in this particular region, we have the value of function as minus one. So we'll put minus one, and this becomes minus of sine n x dx. Okay. And in the next region, we have the limits from zero to pi, and Function the value is one, so we have the integral of sine n x only. This is our uh, expression. Substituting, this becomes one by pi. Integral of sine n x is minus of cos n x, and there was one negative sign already there, so it becomes positive, and this cos n x divided by n. is the integral similarly here cos nx divided by n is the integral in this case but there is a difference of the limits for this we have the limits from minus pi to 0 and for this we have the limits from 0 to pi okay since we know cos 0 is 1 and cos n pi is Minus one raised to the power n, right? We'll substitute these values. What will we get? We'll get this is one by pi. Let's take n also outside the brackets. So this is one by n pi, and rest of the term is cos zero minus cos n pi for minus pi, and minus cos n pi. And minus minus becomes plus. This is for zero cos zero that is one. Okay, taking these becomes double twice of this, so we can write it as two upon n pi. And bracket contains one minus minus one raised to the power n. Right. So this is our b n. This is our b n. we can further solve it we can further solve it what will we get in that case we'll take the values of n since n varies from minus uh, from 1 to infinity so we can take the values of n as odd and even this is bn right so this can be written as this can be written as 2 by n pi is outside the bracket 
and when n is odd minus 1 raised to the power n becomes minus 1 and 1 minus minus 1 becomes 1 plus 1 that is 2 and when n is even minus 1 raised to the power even n gives us plus 1 that is 1 minus 1 gives us 0 so we have vn given by given by 4 upon n pi and 0 this is for odd n and this is for even n ok now we will put this value of bn into this expression we will get function as function is given by summation n is equal to 1 to infinity and we have bn that is this function bn into what was the original function it is into sin nx sin nx we will substitute this value we will got the expansion that we have 4 upon pi summation n is equal to 1 3 5 all the odd values are there and we have rest of the term as sin n pi over n right so now we will just sin n not n pi sin nx sin nx over n now we will just substitute the value of n write it expand it in the given in terms of given options and we will get this is given by 4 by pi and sin 1 sin that is sin 1x by 1 that is sin x next term will be sin 3x by 3 next term will be sin 5x by 5 and so on we can go on writing these terms up to infinity so let us see the correct option ok this contains of plus minus sign this is not possible this contains cos this is also in cos so only option left out is a which is correct which we have already derived it is exact in this form ok so option a is the correct answer to this question so stay tuned with us for more such questions and doubt solving sessions and all the videos and thanks for watching